Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. I am Taylor. Today I'm going to be sharing a grocery haul. I share these every week. So this is our weekly grocery haul. I've been doing a Walmart pickup. First, I'm going to show you guys the meal plan. Then I'm going to show you what my husband got yesterday at the liquor store. He bought me all of the wine because I found some new flavors of Barefoot Moscato that I wanted to try. And I asked him to get them and then he bought me all of them. So I have all of those to try. So I'm going to do that I'm going to show you the meal plan show you that and then we will get into the Walmart haul okay here is the meal plan it is running from April 24th through the 30th so for breakfast ideas we have hash brown casserole I'm going to add some leftover ham in the freezer from Easter and then cinnamon banana bread muffins and then I'm going to make budget Bethany's sausage brunch casserole and then our usual eggs usually toast and fruit but I'm sure we'll have it leftover muffins so we we'll do egg muffins and fruit and then lunch ideas, we have hot dogs and tater tots. If you watched last week's grocery haul, you saw that I got hot dog buns instead of hamburger buns. So I want to use those up. So this week I ordered some hot dogs. So we'll have that and tater tots. Tuna mac and cheese. And then, of course, leftovers. And then dinner ideas. I have some pork carnitas I picked up at Kroger. So we're going to do tacos with that, refried beans and Spanish rice, pizza, pasta, bacon, salad, Instant Pot barbecue chicken legs with air fryer, baked potatoes, and green beans. Baked pork chops and rice with zucchini. And then I'm trying two new recipes from the Pressure Luck YouTube page. I'm going to try Hungarian goulash and his Instant Pot sausage and shells. And then we'll probably do chicken salads. And then I have it on here to prep Andy's breakfast sandwiches because we're out of breakfast sandwiches for him this week. Hey there, friends. Look, it's a puppy. But also, I did a thing, and the thing was I went to the liquor store, and we got uh, we got some of these barefoot, barefoot, barefoot. <laughs> Words are hard. Uh, barefoot fruit scato. You this have not been into this box of liquor yet. You just <laughs> no. All these bottles are full. Um, this is the peach one, and we also got, no, the label says the wrong way, we got the apple one, we got the strawberry one, we got uh, the watermelon one, which apparently doesn't even exist on their website, so we have a non-existent watermelon wine. Uh, we also got... This a vanilla flavored vodka for, for a recipe for a recipe video, <laughs> and then we got some Fireball, cause you know it's Fireball, and I'm I'm gonna drink that. That's that's what we got. That is um that is our uh, liquor store haul to go along with the grocery haul this week. That will probably last a very long time because that's. Because I barely even drink wine. <laughs> yes. Yeah. But I wanted to try all the flavors, so now I have all of the flavors. All of the flavors. Okay, here is everything that I ordered. They were out of two things, and then I had a couple substitutions. They did not have strawberries, and they did not have sour cream, so I will just have to live without those. But the total for all of this was $144. So we'll start over here with the non-food items. I like to have the kids put their dirty socks in one of these little laundry bags. So the zipper on the old one broke. It was from Dollar Tree, so it was pretty crappy. So I bought this one from Walmart. Got some more of these color catchers. I really like those. Some hydrocortisone cream for when we get bug bites. I ordered the big one of the Walmart dishwashing liquid. They were out, so they gave me two of the small ones. Some bird seed and a bird feeder. The kids had a little tiny bird feeder that they got for Easter. So they wanted some bird seed to put in it. And then I went ahead and ordered a bigger bird feeder that'll hold more of this seed. And then we needed more light bulbs. I ordered the four pack, they were out. So they just gave me four of the one packs. And then I ordered this rug. This is like $4 for this little rug. I ordered it to go by the back door because the kids are in and out and bringing in all of the dirt. So I hope that this will help with that. And that is all of the non-food items. And then moving over here, we got the humongous pack of these cereal bars. The kids really like these. So these have strawberry, apple, and cinnamon, and mixed berry in there. 
Andy asked for some pretzel rods for snacks at work, so we got those. Some more of these barbecue chips. These are really, really good, and they're really cheap, too. It's like $1.50 for this giant bag. Got some cranberry raspberry juice, some more granola for the kids to have with their yogurt, some marshmallows to make a fun treat, some more Mio Energy for Andy, taco shells, refried beans. I ordered the small can, but they gave me the big one. Cream of chicken soup for some recipes, more Olive Garden, and I went ahead and ordered the big one this time because it's cheaper that way if you're getting it at Walmart. Andy wanted some honey mustard to go with those pretzel rods, so I got that. And then I'm actually going to try to make some homemade like soft pretzels. So I got this kosher salt to go on top, some onion soup mix for recipes, four gallons of milk, two things of orange juice. This was a substitution I ordered, the Borzen, I think is how you say it, garlic and herb cheese. It's the one that the Pressure Look guy uses. But they didn't have it, so they had this one. At least it's the same flavor, so it should be good. Elijah, where'd you go? My pointer went away. I'm getting it sold. <laughs> Got some of these Totino's pizza. We were out, so I ordered four. I actually ordered the combination. They gave me triple meat. Greek yogurt to make Andy's breakfast sandwiches. String cheese. Sliced cheddar cheese. We were out of cheddar cheese, like completely. Got a big block of white sharp cheddar and a big block of extra sharp cheddar. Two things of eggs, tater tots, hash browns. I've been seeing this everywhere and I thought the kids would like it. Unicorn sparkle ice cream. Hot dogs. We got some apples. English cucumber. Baby carrots. Grape tomatoes. Big slicing tomato. What are those? Bananas. Bananas. What are these? Avocado. What is this? Cinnamon. What is this? Zucchini. What is this? Strawberry. Nope. We didn't have strawberries. Remember, what are these? Blackberry. Radishes. Oh. You like those? Yeah. Sprite with ginger because it's delicious and I don't know if they're going to have it forever. So I'm going to keep ordering it as long as it's on there. Got some honey wheat bread. I ordered the Walmart one. They gave me Sarah Lee. And then bagels because in Amanda, Mom's Messy Kitchen's grocery haul, she talked about how she was eating peanut butter on bagels. And I haven't had that in so long. And it sounded delicious because I used to do that all the time. So I got those. And that is everything. And that is going to be it for this week's grocery haul. If you enjoyed it, please make sure you leave me a thumbs up. And if you haven't tried Walmart grocery pickup before, I always have my link down below so that you guys can save $10 and you help me out so I can save $10. Because without that, this would have been $155 instead of $144 and some change. So thank you guys for always using my link. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!